Hello tech people. In this video, we are going to see the updated method to program the DigiSpark AT Tiny 85 using the Arduino IDE. Let's get started. For those who might not be familiar, the AT Tiny 85 is a microcontroller that packs quite a punch for its size. With just eight pins, it can handle a variety of tasks for your projects, making it a fantastic choice for small electronics. First, you need the Digistump drivers. Go to the Digistump GitHub releases page and download the drivers package. Link is in the description. Extract the downloaded file. Inside the extracted folder, depending on your operating system, run one of these two files. I am using a 64-bit system, so I open this. Install all the drivers. Next, we need to install the AT Tiny Core boards. Open Arduino IDE, go to File, Preferences, and open the Additional Boards Manager URL section. Paste the URL for the AT Tiny Core boards. All the URLs are in the description. Click on OK. Then go to the Boards Manager and search for AT Tiny. Then install this board here, the AT Tiny Core. Now, before we start uploading, the DigiSpark boards come preloaded with a Micronucleus bootloader. So the following steps will work only if the board has the bootloader. Let's try uploading a Blink sketch now. Select Tools, Board, AT Tiny Core, and AT Tiny 85 Micronucleus slash DigiSpark. We don't need to select a port. Select the programmer as Micronucleus. Now open the Blink sketch. If you have the board connected to your computer, remove it. Then click on Upload and wait till you see this message asking to connect the board. Now plug the board in. Code will be uploaded and the LED should start blinking. That's it. You have the AT Tiny 85 ready for your projects. If this video helped you, leave a like and comment if you have questions.